He even noticed when I ran away. Ooh, I wish I could go down there and thrash the life out of him! Joe Marchie will do no such thing! I will bring him a letter. Oh, great. I'll show him. Let me bandage your hands. Mr. Davis, what right do you have to strike a child? I do not believe in corporal punishment, especially for young girls. This type of discipline does not foster growth and maturity, only fear and shame. Now, Amy, do you think you can study at home like Beth does every day? Yes, Marnie. Good. I will be withdrawing Amy from your school. I get to leave school. <laughs> yes. But you did deserve punishment for your disobedience. You're becoming rather conceited, my dear, and it's quite that time you set about correcting them. If you spend half as much time on your studies as you did that little nose of yours, you'd be quite a good student. You have a good many good little virtues if you be humble and people will notice them without you need to announce them. All right, Mommy. I'll try to do better. Good. Now, Joe, I will need you to help Amy with her studies. What? What? <laughs>